the chick's first time outside. Yippee! We can't stay out too long, though. They're still using a heat lamp. Let me, I'm trying to get at least the majority of them. Oh, there, now they're all there. Oh, now. Are you talking to your babies, Crowley? Uh, hey, Persephone, no. Hey, no. You totally ignore them when they're in the house, but now when they're out here, they're fair game? Yeah, I don't think so. Hi guys, it's Laura from Mad Mimi's Crochet and Farmy. Um, and it is Bod Hatapalooza. And we just finished doing a V-stitch baby hat. I think that is what it was called. Let me check. I have the new hat up there. So yes, the V-stitch beanie hat with a flower. Um, I made mine a uh, baby size. And I used a repeat of yarn. Because I am trying to use some yarn up. I used... Gazal, uh, okay, here we go. Gazal XL Baby Wool, and I used two different colors. I used a pink and a white. It's 40% acrylic, 20% cashmere, and what's the other part? 40% uh, merino. So this is these are the two colors that I held together. And I used a J 6 millimeter Clover Amore hook. And this is what my hat looks like. Uh here this is what I'm holding my scrap pieces with so uh, okay so yes this will get donated but there is the hat I did not use both colors for the flower I just used the pink so um, actually I think this will go to the new baby Emily that is coming along she is due in uh, December, I think it is. So yes, this is probably who it will go to. I have an, there's another one coming up in uh, September. So yeah, I have a couple of babies that are coming up. So that is my hat. Um, I love it. I think it's cute. I did one roche, uh, fewer than, um, Crystal did. It, um, she did nine rounds and I did only eight. So, um, that's it. This one was a super quick, super easy one. I think I did this one in an hour, maybe a little bit longer. Well, you know, I get a little, I have the ADHD, so, you know, I was outside, I took the chickens out for the first time, and, um, so, yeah, I was having fun, you know, uh, watching the chickens play in the grass for the first time. All right, so, you guys ready to find out what hat is next? Um... Siri pick number 45, I think. Let me check. She's, or she or he has been staying, uh, no, he picked number 42. Um, number 14 was last. So he's been staying in the, in the pretty 
pretty much in the two dub the the upper two digits. So number forty two on my list is easy to crochet beanie hat candy visions and it's a uh, bod tutorial number 532 tutorial number 532 um for those of you uh for those of you who don't like bobbles hmm, sorry charlie um for those of you who want to pick a number um send me an email and I'll do it on a first come first serve basis if we have not had that number drawn already um so if you want to pick a number email me my email is always listed below um yep yeah. sounds good so, um, I am not sure what yarn she used, um, but it, it is a multicolor yarn. It does have many, many, let me see how many rounds. Oh, one, two, three. It looks like four rounds of bobbles. Too bad. So sad. Jan. <laughs> I know Jan doesn't like bobbles. So, um, make sure you uh, stay tuned to see all of the hats that were sent to me uh, in my email. If you want your hat included in um, the video, send it to me in email and I will get it up and um, in the video. So, uh, other social media I'm on Pinterest you can find me on Pinterest um, I have lots of homeschooling information I have um, lots of geocaching information uh, a, a wide variety of, of different things that went with our homeschool um, different arts and crafts that we did uh, some we liked, some we didn't. Uh, what else? Um, you can find me on Ravelry. I'll put that link below. Um, I do not accept friend requests on Facebook, um, mainly because I am very rarely on Facebook. And, um, and I mean, pretty much I will probably disappear from Facebook pretty soon. I, uh... And yes, so I think that's, yeah, I don't, I used to do Instagram. I, I don't do Instagram anymore. Um, I don't even know what my password is and I'm not going to make a new one. So yeah, you can find me on Pinterest and uh, Ravelry. That's about the only things that I do. Um, I, I don't pay attention to all of the political stuff that goes on. Um, at Ravelry, um, I just use it to, um, to make sure that I get all of the things that I had planned to get done for the year done. Um, so yes, that, that is how I do with my Ravelry. So, um, that's all. Don't forget to stick, stay tuned for the slideshow. So, Thank you guys for watching. You guys have a great day, and I will see you next Tuesday for another edition of Bod Adapalooza. Bye-bye.